A U.S. veteran of the Korean War is being held by North Korea right now. The Guardian is reporting that an 85 year old U.S. veteran of the Korean War has been detained in North Korea since last month, according to his family. Merrill Newman's son, Jeffrey, told the San Jose Mercury News that his father has been take had been taken off of a plane that was set to leave North Korea on October 26th with no explanation at all. His travel uh, buddy was allowed to return and said that this has to be a terrible misunderstanding. He hopes North Korea will see this as a humanitarian matter and allow him to go. There aren't really diplomatic relations between the U.S. and North Korea. So other countries are involved here uh, trying to negotiate some kind of a release. Uh, a Swedish ambassador was able to bring over uh, Merrill's uh, Merrill Newman's heart medication just a horrible situation. And some people emailed me. Two people sent me stuff about the story saying, why does an 85 year old with a heart condition go to North Korea? I, I mean, OK, I understand uh, that idea, which is um, does it really make sense knowing that you were a veteran of the Korean War and that you're 85? Does it really make sense to go there at the same time? Maybe he thought I'm 85. When will I have another chance to see North Korea, which I really want to do? Um, hopefully they can negotiate his release soon, Lewis, and this doesn't turn into a much worse situation. What do you think this guy is doing there? I don't know. Uh, do they, do, does he, he just, have books? Is he just sitting in a cell? Like what, what, I, it's just horrible. I can't even imagine, but the U S really needs to, uh, flex its muscles and get this guy back, uh, enough of this diplomatic, uh, diplomatic crap. Yeah. Like, but Lewis, just you, I over. think that's almost what North Korea wants flexing muscles. And then they kill the guy or who knows? I mean, I, I think that that's what they're trying to cause here. Well, David, uh, we're the ones that have the upper hand. OK, well, let's let's hope Lewis is right and that this leads to a satisfactory conclusion.